Hey everybody, welcome back to Against the Storm. It's been quite a while since we last played, and this new update out soon on August 13th. Really, that's when we want to play it again. They've added a new playable species, the fox, along with a few other things. Uh, Hooded Horse was nice enough to send over a early access copy of this build for me to check out. Like I said, the new update to Against the Storm Early Access comes out on August 13th next, or this coming Thursday. You're seeing this on the weekend sometime, I think. Uh, so, yeah. I play this game way too much. It's one of my best played games on Steam. I absolutely love it. So, yeah. There are a lot of new buildings. There are a lot of new things. Uh, so we're going to be playing. I'm playing on the experimental branch, so I don't have my current campaign. Um... Which is pretty expensive, uh, but I mean, it is what it is, right? You do what you have to do. Just going to do here and let's buy the obsidian archive. Oh, it's already unlocked because it's the experimental branch. Oh, okay. I know how to play. I know how to play. I know how to play. I played this way too much. I have too many hours in this game. Yeah, thanks to the Hood and Horse guys, I, as always, for sending over early access to this build. I love what they're doing over there, so I'm always happy to lend a hand and promote whatever I can with their stuff, so. Yeah, as always, like the like, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, do all that sort of stuff, and let's get into our first run. Hopefully with some foxes. Yeah, so we're gonna try and make it to where we have some foxes right off the bat here. And I think we're gonna do this one here. So summary, conditions. I've done that. We're going to stick with the, uh, it's, everything is unlocked. You can go to Prestige 20. I'm nowhere near that, but I think we're going to stick with, uh, Pioneer for this. Uh, Fox, Foxes 1. And, yep. I've been ready to embark on my own for the past 2 minutes and 51 seconds. A Fox is 1. This is going to be the one we choose. Uh, we can choose nine of these items. Uh, well, not necessarily. There are embarkation points that prevent us from using them. Um, let's choose meat. That is two points. Let's choose wood. That is one point. Let's choose... How many parts do we start off with? 28. Okay. Stone, planks, eggs, I don't know, let's do, I think vegetables might be a better thing to do here, so let's do vegetables, um, and embark. So here are the new, uh, the new things, the new species, the fox species, voted on by the community. I voted on the frogs, uh, but I'm perfectly okay with the foxes. They turned out to look really good, uh, so I'm very impressed with how they look. Yeah. Let's get into some building, though. I think that's why you're here. I think you're here to see someone who's barely competent enough against the storm play the new update. That's what... That's what you're here for, and I'm here to oblige. So we're just going to go ahead and the space to resume. Let's go ahead and, first of all, go through our three things. A forager's camp might be of a good thing. Greenhouse, I don't have unlocked in my own game yet. I haven't gotten that far. I play slow. Not because I... Feel, not because I don't know what I'm doing. Because I like playing slow. I just like playing slower than the average player. It gives me time to think and everything. So I do play a little slower. 
uh, than most players. But I enjoy that. Um, so that's a fair warning here. And as I said, uh, you're probably going to be seeing this on Friday or Saturday. Um, and again, on Thursday when this update comes out, as well as on Friday, uh, next Friday we'll be doing our new Total War Warhammer 3 Realms of Chaos campaign, and then on Saturday our Immortal Empires campaign. So the whole schedule is about to be turned on its head for good reason, because everything is coming out all at once here. Uh, so let's do the Forager's Camp here. Supplier, uh, Weaver, Granary, Kiln. I think Kiln's probably a good thing there. A beanery. We can make beans. Oh, we can't make beans. And let's do the brick out. Alright, so we gotta go hard and fast here to get stuff done. So let's go ahead and put our I'll do woodcutters camp here and here. Let's go ahead and do that. Reveal location for the soil. Do that. Uh, shelter, we need, we have 11 pop. So we need, this house is three, so we need four. Four houses, we're gonna do one, two, three, four. We're gonna do some roads. I'll unpause the game once I get all this planning done. Uh, there we go. Do roads there, there, there. Delete that one. There. And there we go. You have some things you can do. So do them. My friendlies. Once we get these guys in here. I wish we had beavers, but uh, maybe we'll get beavers here later on in the campaign. Later on. The I got a campaign. It's more of a run, because one village is a run. Uh, let's do, we have nine well, boxes. Let's well, do two of each here. First bit of quests. Oh, this is a cornerstone, actually. Okay. So we have three rerolls um, we can use throughout. Forest of Nature. The forest and the everlasting river are connected somehow. Gain plus one to stormwater reduction for every two woodcutters in your settlement. Expect to gain two. Friendly relations boost global resolve by one for every three levels of standing with other settlements and trade routes. A farmer's favorite food. Farmers have a Plus 75% chance of producing double yields. Or another effect of biscuit. Or specialized away from. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, let's do Force of Nature. Everyone seems happy. Positive, focused. We got our first batch of orders. Let's throw down that. Three of them. The trading post. We have these boxed, or we'll have these boxed. Um, and five, a deliver five amber. Uh, this one feels more worth it to me. Need for shelter fulfilled. Have at least... If we're going to do that one, that's a pretty easy one. Just need the wood. Call of the Ruin. The nine-minute timed one. Two glades and one rebuild or salvage road. We have two glades in process right now. 
So I think we're going to go ahead and maybe try that because I don't want to do these two. These are value things. I don't, I don't, I'm not one that prefers the valuation orders. We're going to, we're going to try that when it's time locked. So let's do it. Okay, so we have that one completely done. Let's go ahead and click deliver. Throw down a human, throw down a couple humans, start gathering berries for us. Swamp, wheat fields, swarm bird nest. Already a water geyser for drizzle water. Copper vein. Oh, we already have access. We have access to a lot of materials that I tend to use pretty fast here. So that is a good... RNG. Jesus is with us today. Um, ranch, herb garden, greenhouse, furnace... We have the copper mines already, so we're going to go ahead and go and grab the furnace. We're going to keep, we're gonna have to go like gung-ho for this one. We already have the first glade. The other glade is making its it's making its strides. Let's go ahead and build the uh, trading post. We have the resources we need. How many? Ten. Okay. Yeah. Do that. Got a couple more paths. Getting a bit cramped right now. I'm gonna start tanking that water because we're gonna need it. We start piping stuff. Being pipes and stuff laid later in the campaign. A uh, traitor is in five minutes. This one isn't timed, so I'm gonna wait. If this one was timed, I would, I would take the half impatience point to get the amber, because then we cancel it out by getting the five amber, and the whole point would go away. So we're at how much right now? We're at. 0.43 and it's only going up 0.16 a minute. Ah, uh, let's do that. So you can just start gathering the water. There you go. Already up to 68 wood, not bad. 520 on this one. How did that one get there? I'm trying to uncramp this space a little up here, so if I can move that back a little bit, I'm gonna do it. So it's fertile soil right in this one. Everything on this quest is riding on the fact 
that this may have a ruin. Only possibly. That's the thing. Only possibly. Four minutes, ten seconds to do this. That one's nearly done, as is this one. I think that one's perched up enough in the trees now to make me happy enough to leave it where it is for the moment. Until we run out of trees in the area. I'm ready to hear that oh-so-wonderful sound that you get when you, uh, find a glade. <laughs> 